His Highness the Aga Khan, accompanied by members of his family, attends the inauguration of the Nardin campus of the University of Central Asia. This is a great day for the University of Central Asia and for me, and for all those who have participated in the development of this university in Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, and Tajikistan. And I know that now is also a very special day for the people of the Kyrgyz Republic and for the leaders and the citizens of Narin. Biz ilim menen bilimdi barından çoğuru bağlayan el biz. Bilim bizdin ölkü ölçün ruhani muhtazlık kanemez önügünün negizgi resurslarından biri. O sonduktan bilim çöresini önüktürü Located in Kyrgyz Republic, the Nadin campus is the first of three campuses to be built. The remaining two are under construction in Horog, Tajikistan, and Tekeli in Kazakhstan. UCA was founded to be a catalyst for development in the region's mountain societies. UCA is the first institution in Central Asia that is a commitment to development as a core objective. Today, in its operational state, this campus has trained and provided full-time employment to over 60 members of the Narin community. The university's future growth will also offer important opportunities for local enterprise development and employment. UCA's first cohort of 71 students was selected from a pool of 600 applicants on the basis of academic merit and leadership qualities. They're from the three founding states, as well as Pakistan and Afghanistan. Your Highness, you have spent years advocating for pluralism and diversity around the world, and I truly believe that this Narin campus is an embodiment of your vision. As beautiful as the mountains are around us, they have physically divided people in Central Asia for hundreds of years, and this has posed a large challenge to our region. However, being here, we all have realized that education can unite people despite the boundaries and altitudes of the mountains. We, the inaugural class of 2021, realized that while we enjoy the benefits of this campus, we also carry important responsibilities with us. Each of us, each of us is responsible to take the knowledge we receive and gain here and applying it to the larger world. We are responsible to serve the people who reside not only in our local communities, but also those across the globe. What this university is all about is not only the power of education, but also the power of international cooperation. It is a power that can change people's lives. It is important to know that what we are doing here will be a valuable example of international cooperation for the future, not only here in the region, but also for people far beyond the region. What we celebrate today is not the first phase of this story of growth and progress, but it is still an early step. Even as we rejoice today, we look forward to the many wonderful steps that are still to come. Thank you.